As a designer interested in new software, you've got a lot of questions and we love to help. You might be asking yourself if it's worth spending the money on expensive software or do you need something different than what other professionals use? We're here at Inspiration That's 2D ready with answers and maybe some killer insights about two major tools for graphic design that are widely used by professionals, Adobe Photoshop and Procreate. So first things first, what is Procreate? Procreate is a digital graphics software that enables you to create masterful designs without the hefty price tags of other apps. It came out in 2011 and has been gaining momentum ever since. Its modern design makes it easy for illustrators like yourself who are looking for high-quality artwork at an affordable cost. Procreate is a revolutionary software for drawing and painting that has been met with much critical acclaim. It's designed to exclusively take advantage of the Apple Pencil, as well as iPads with touchscreens. But it does not require you to have any previous experience using these devices or apps in order to create beautiful artwork. Procreate has all the tools you need for an incredible artistic experience. From drawing in digital mode, painting and sketching with rich colors on a canvas-sized background, or creating simple animations. Looking at the other side of the comparison, what is Adobe Photoshop? Adobe Photoshop was created way back in 1987, but it's regularly updated and considered to be at the forefront of design technology. Professional creatives have long used apps from the Adobe family for a variety of purposes. They're known for lasting through time with ease. It's an excellent tool for creating graphics and images. The program was created to edit photos, but it can be used as a general purpose design package too. The power and flexibility of Adobe Photoshop is a gem that every creative professional needs to stay ahead in their industry. The Creative Cloud offers desktop versions, so you can work on your designs from wherever life takes you. With a wide range of tools, including advanced brush settings and more, the Adobe Creative Cloud desktop applications work best. It also has an app for iPads so users can access it on the go as well. Now, let's look at the comparison from a specific angle. Why and when Procreate is better than Photoshop? In our opinion, there are a few reasons. Sketching is easy. It's a great setup for sketching, and the feel is much like drawing on real paper. There are easy ways to adjust your perspective, as well as zoom in Procreate, which makes workflow effortless. Brushes. The default brush set in Procreate is vast and offers a wide range of styles to suit any project. Users can also play around with the settings for their own custom-made brushes or simply use one from within this great tool. The latest update to Adobe's professional painting app, Procreate will now allow users who use Photoshop as their brush engine to send files that can be used by other applications. This means that you won't need a different workflow for working on projects both at home and while traveling. We love how Procreate's brushes are organized. You can have separate folders for different ones, like charcoal or pencil, and all your recent creations will be saved in a recent folder that you may not have seen before with the latest 5.2 updates. Palettes of colors. You can create different color combinations for a variety of needs with the new design. You'll be able to save them and switch between default palettes easily as well. Plus, there are 15 pre-made colors, or you could take your own photos in order to get inspiration from it too. A simple, artist-friendly design. Procreate is an app that provides artists of all skill levels simplicity and accessibility. Though it has a lot going on in its interface, once you get used to where everything goes, there's really not much else for users who haven't yet mastered every feature available within the program, which makes Procreate perfect even if you're beginner status. Portability Procreate offers an unparalleled experience to express your creativity. You can draw anywhere with its powerful features that work on both tablets and smartphones. So there are no limits, except for how much battery power you have. Lettering Procreate has a lot to offer for lettering artists, but one of the best features is that it lets you create brush settings that are easily adjustable and mimic those found in Photoshop or other programs. Capturing time lapses 
Procreate's built-in time-lapse feature makes it easy to create beautiful paintings without the need for any recording programs. You can even see how much paint has been used and share your speed paint video instantly online. The other way around is also a legit question. Why and when Photoshop is better than Procreate? Again, there are a few reasons in our opinion. A standard software package for industry. Adobe Photoshop has been a proven leader in creating and editing raster imagery for years, so it's no surprise that companies and digital studios all over the world use it as a default software in their offices. If you're a beginner in digital art, I would highly recommend you learn Photoshop first, because it will give you points in karma when applying for a job. Many companies simply state this as a strict requirement. Brushes Photoshop has been around for a long time, so it's no wonder there are already tons of brushes created for it. You can find almost every brush you need on the internet, and if you're using Photoshop for some time, you may have already collected your own unique set of favorite brushes. To my joy, Photoshop brushes can now be transferred to Procreate. Multifunctionality It's not a secret that Adobe Photoshop has a whole bunch of different options not only for illustrating, but also for photo editing. As the name suggests, Photoshop was originally created for dealing with photos, but you can also use it for other things like web design and printing. Layers Depending on their memory storage and your canvas size, different iPads allow you to use a limited amount of layers in Procreate. Photoshop, on the contrary, allows you to utilize hundreds of layers, which is vital for complex projects and highly detailed drawings. You are indeed free to edit every layer you've created at a certain point without a need to merge them every once in a while. Adjustment layers Photoshop has this advantage over Procreate in our opinion. Using adjustment layers allows you to change the colors of your whole artwork, not just individual layers. Photo filters, contrast and brightness are just some of the options that can be applied to a number of layers at once. The syntax for keyboard shortcuts your workflow can be significantly sped up by using keyboard shortcuts. You can create your own or use those built in. In Procreate, you can assign functions to certain gestures, but these functions are limited when compared with others. Vector masks Procreate does not have vectors. A vector mask cannot be created for your layers, nor can a vector shade be drawn neatly. Fortunately, Photoshop is up to the task in this respect. The monitor size. Photoshop allows you to choose an appropriate monitor size. Procreate, on the other hand, can only be used on a 12.9 inch iPad screen so far. The iPad screen is usually much smaller than your monitor. When it comes to pricing, a one time fee of about $10 is required for Procreate to be purchased through the App Store. On the other hand, it's roughly $21 per month to subscribe to Photoshop but it's around $53 to pay for the entire Adobe Creative Cloud. Photoshop is the industry standard tool that can tackle everything from photo editing and graphic design to animation, but Procreate makes it more intuitive than Photoshop overall, allowing you greater control of each element and making anything imaginable possible. Even without ever having drawing or painting experience beforehand, if you're dedicated enough. With its powerful feature set, compatibility across both Mac and Windows platforms, as well as an ages-old reputation for excellence, Adobe Photoshop takes the cake. Procreate is undoubtedly a great addition to your toolbox, but when compared against this ultimate winner, it simply doesn't measure up. We hope you found this video useful and informative. Feel free to give it a thumbs up if it helped you choose your next favorite tool. And subscribe for more content like this. Comment below if you think that we've missed something or if you have any other suggestions. Thank you for watching as always and see you next time.